telling you right now. We're gonna talk about this film, okay? We're gonna make make a make movie, um, a movie about emojis, and what we're gonna do is that we're gonna have the emojis be like characters, and we're gonna have them express different kinds of expressions because that's apparently taboo, and we can't have them do that. So what we're gonna do is that we're gonna have them come in this movie, and we're gonna take them around the smartphone world with tons of product placements and stuff like that. You know what? It's a great idea to make. I'm telling you right now, we have to do this as soon as possible. Fund this movie. I know we've made two great hit movies in the past. We've made movies like Baby Driver and, uh, and Spider-Man Homecoming. But you know what? We need to make a movie like this. What do you think about this? I think it's a great idea. Yeah? Oh my god. That hit was strong. <laughs>
the Lego movie was also about Legos. That wasn't supposed to work out, and then it turned out to be two really good movies in the last few years. So I'm thinking, hey, if that could be done for the Lego movie, and it could be done for Inside Out, where you're looking at your own mind, then sure as hell you can make it work out for the emojis as well. You never know what you can accomplish. But they're so lazy, and they're so contrived in doing it, that there's really no point in doing it. And the product placement, oh my god, because of course, these enough smartphone you're going to see apps Facebook Twitter there's a bird the Twitter bird actually comes in in one scene and helps them out and flies around the smartphone to certain locations I am NOT even kidding about this the Twitter bird does that <sighs> There's a point where they're riding the waves of music on the Spotify app. There's a point where they're playing Candy Crush. There's a scene where they have to do a dance because it's the Just Dance app and the woman is like, you gotta do it. And so we have this entire sequence over there. Who came up with this? Really? Why would you do that? It makes the movies like Transformers. Transformers gets a lot of crap for product placement and stuff, right? It makes those movies look subtle in comparison. And now I'm not saying that this movie was not gonna have any product placement at all because of course it was. It's a movie about emojis in a phone. You are going to see apps, but you have to be better about it than the way it's shown in this movie. They try for about three seconds and then it turns into a big advertisement because they start with the Candy Crush thing and you're thinking, okay, and then they drop the logo in the middle like, it's Candy Crush. I'm like, oh, that... You're, you're, you're doing this. You're, you're actually doing this. There's a plot about them wanting to get to Dropbox. <laughs> Dropbox? Really? WeChat is shown at one point. That's just the way things are. This movie is one big marketing thing. The score is bad, the humor is flat, the writing is atrocious. But the ending of this movie makes no sense. Not just in a general sense, not like as a normal film goer, but even in the world that's been established. It makes absolutely zero sense. But it happens nonetheless, and it, it just, it's a thing. It's there. And I think it's actually the most offensive thing about this film. The reviewer actually said it best. If it feels like a three hour movie and like an hour and a half movie, that's not good. You're doing a terrible job. That's this movie. It feels like a three hour film. It feels like a slog. None of it was interesting. The Emoji Movie is one of the worst animated movies I've ever seen. And it's one of the worst movies I've seen this year, if not the worst. It actually is a contender for the worst movie right now. I hated this movie. I'm gonna give the Emoji Movie an F. Thanks, thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry if this seemed more like a rant than an actual review, but... What, what do you want me to say? What do you want me to say? You guys are the best. Thank you so much as always for watching. If you like this, please subscribe, and I will see you guys later.